in the trenches with Ryan Roxy. Um, before we get on to heading out onto the highway, Anders, Anders Lindholm really wanted me to make sure I ask you the question you ask a lot of people. Do you have a one that got away in terms of your guitars or gear? Oof, I do. Wow, that's a good question. And, and a lot of people don't know about the story of the off-colored white, the off-white cream-colored Strat that I got as my first electric guitar. The first electric guitar I got from Santa Claus. Um, I was very young. I, I appreciate Santa giving sound advice to my mom and dad at that point, at that Christmas, at whatever it was. And the true story is <laughs> early in the morning before Christmas and you open up presents and stuff, I snuck into the Christmas room, Christmas street, and I saw the case and I opened it up and it was kind of like seeing the Holy Grail. It's like, I opened up, it's like, ah! And it was this cream colored strat and with a white pick guard, exactly like uh, uh, Jimi Hendrix's, you know, Stratocaster. And then I, then I went to my mom and dad's bedroom at that time, they were still married. And um, I literally couldn't sleep, but then I had to act surprised when, Chris, when, when it came to say time to open up the gifts. So I went, oh, guitar even though the whole time i hadn't been able to sleep so i got this guitar and i played with it and played and learned a lot of what uh, the basics and fundamentals kind of like what i teach with system 12 i but i was learning it the hard way not the easy way with system 12 <laughs> i was learning you know the, i took the long road instead of the sh instead of the shortcut road and eventually i figured out that heavy music you needed a humbucker pickup and this guitar, I could never get the heaviest sound because they, they bought a Fender Stratocaster with a Fender VibroChamp amp. And a VibroChamp amp at that point, the best it could, you wanted to get that Fender VibroChamp amp sounding great, you had to turn it on to a 10. You had to turn every knob all the way up and it kind of sounded a little bit rough, but it was so loud. It, it was, you'd hear it blocks away. And even for a small amp. But then, when I figured out you needed humbucker pickups, I sold it to a buddy that I think was in either junior high or first year in high school. I think I sold it to Rob Lyons. That's his name. Go look him. Go look so him if you're out there, Rob, it. and you know where this guitar is. <laughs> is it Jeffrey Lyons? I'm not sure. Um, no, the thing is I sold it to him in order to get a – Ibanez Destroyer, which is was a, basically a Gibson Explorer. Ibanez Destroyer, Gibson Explorer. It was kind of like a, you know, they made candy apple red and a blue one. Well, I got a candy apple red one instead. So I honestly, to this day, feel I, I always wanted that Stratocaster back. Um, but that's what that's why I have the Never Say Never Strat, is that was close to what I ended up um, getting back was a white Stratocaster. The guys at Palermo put together this Stratocaster that uh, has a double coil in the back. So it's got the best of both worlds, double coil in the back and a, a single, I think it's called an HCC, humbucker single, single. And um, that never say never Strat is the one that I play to this day. And um, that's been a couple of years now. So it's, it's sort of a, a nice throwback to my original strat but you know someday i'm going to own that original strat again and if i can find that exact one that'll so, be the one that got back well there's oh, wow, one there's that a, did get away yeah there's another one that got away that's that's the red white and blue gmp roxy guitar but you know what i have no problem it getting away to a hard rock cafe in uh in los angeles because i know where it's at <laughs> and i can always that, go and check it out if i want to that location's closed now it's gone. Oh, well then, damn. So then... It's it's in the vault somewhere, probably in Florida, or it's been moved to another If anyone restaurant. sees that uh, red, white, and blue GMP, uh, tell us where it, it is. Tell us yeah. where it is. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm Ryan Roxy, and I've taken all my years of experience of playing guitar, and I want to pass the torch of rock and roll on to you. Check out the System 12 Guitar Method.